Hey guys, it's Yvette and I have a whole, whole lot of Tilda and Liberty Club to share with you guys. It's Tilda Club, the Liberty Fabric Club. I know I'm always saying this wrong. They're like, I listen, I love the fabric. Oh my gosh, I'm terrible at remembering the names of the darn things. But I am going to have this super duper opening. I am going to be showing you one quarter of Tilda Club, and then I have three months <laughs> of the Liberty Fabric League. So I can't wait to uh, show all of it to you. The first thing I'm gonna show you is the Tilda, because I've been having this for quite a while, and I, life is running me, is basically what's happening. So I am so ready to open all of this and show it to you. Here we go. Now, first thing I'm gonna do, is I'm going to just take out the note that comes with. She puts it inside um, the fabric. Now, I am a quarterly member of the Tilda Club, which means that I get um, the whole collection of Tilda fabric all at one time. And I think we were able to like choose the size. I don't know. I always say I think, but we're able to choose the size of the fabric that we wanted. And um I always get as much as she'll possibly give me. So I'm quite sure that that is half a yard. <laughs> and I so I have half a yard of the entire collection. I can't wait to show this to you. Here we go. Okay. So it says, um, you are a classic. I hope you have a wonderful late summer. Love, Julie. And then there's all of this uh, stuff that's in the box. Holy cow, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, I'm going to like stand this up so that I can read it from across the way here. But make sure I got everything. I have 20 pieces of pretty fabric, as she puts it. So I'm going to pull that out now. And y'all, look at it. This is it. Oh my goodness. And you know I'm going to show them to you one at a time. So you're going to know, uh, you're going to see all of this fabric. I'm unknotting it. It had a knot. Okay. Here you go, baby. I gave that to JB. He likes the fabric. Or, I mean the uh the ribbons. Uh yeah, this is this is a half yard. Um so here is the first piece. And I don't remember what this is. This is uh Sophie by Brenda Riddle Designs. Home of Acorn Quilt and Gift Company. And this is for Moda. And I have some of the gingham from this uh, collection in my shop, I think. Uh, but this is the first one. And this collection, uh, Sophie, is um, very much like uh, Tilda. So this is one of the... I think it was that... Tilda's going to come out with three collections throughout the year. And we, if you're on quarterly, you're going to get it four times a year. So one of the collections you're going to get is going to be Tilda-like. I think there was like, there were two different options. And I think I took the one that was Tilda-like. Yeah, I had to look into that and see if maybe it's something I want to switch up so that you guys could see what's, you know, the other option and then you would see that next year because it's gonna you know it's gonna rotate depending on um when the tilde comes out okay here is um fabric number two very girly <laughs> this is fabric number three This is number four. Number five. I love the colors of this collection. I just, the anything that goes with the pink and the green and the white, I just, I love that. Oh goodness, I think this is number six. Yeah, I think so. Number five. 
Number seven. This looks so much better in person. <laughs> Number eight. Number nine. Number ten. Number eleven. Number 12, 13, fourteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Nineteen and twenty. Okay, so that is Sophie by Brenda Riddle Designs. Let me move that over for a little bit here. And then here is my Tilda box. And it comes all wrapped up like this. Okay, this is a magnetic needle keeper and um, it is our my year two of Tilda Club little, pre little present. And okay, so there is some stuff here that I'm sure it goes with the pattern. So I'm gonna like get in there and do that. This is, oh, cool. Okay, wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna like, cause uh, the, uh, there are some little rulers here, but I think they go with stuff. So I'm gonna like try to show them at the same time so you can see everything that it goes with. Um, I have like a little candy right here. I love biscotti. It's not really candy. This is actually a biscuit. <laughs> A Biscoff. I love those. Um, okay, so I'm going to pull out the patterns out so that I can tell you and then I'll show you what went with. Okay, um, first we have a Patchwork Notebook Pal. It measures five and a half inches by eight inches. This is what it looks like. You can see that. Um, let's see. Does this use? Okay, it looks like this um, uses the piece of elastic that she gave us. So yeah, this woo 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 woo, a little white piece of elastic. Oh, my nose is just. Um, and the zipper, got a little white zipper. And I think that's all that we needed for that. Okay, so we have that pattern, which is way cool. And then I have a pattern for a patchwork needle holder. And this one measures, um, when it's closed, 
it is five inches by four and a half inches. And when it's open, it is 10 inches by four and a half inches. So there it is. And it looks like that when it's open. And for this, she gave us, um, okay, she gave us the lace that we would need. So we have our piece of lace. And um, this piece is for the inside as well. It is a piece of felt for the inside. And making sure I tell you everything. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's it. Okay, so that those are the things we got for that pattern. And then we have a pattern um, for a picture pouch. And it looks like that. And oh, I'll explain the rulers. It's on here. I can see it now. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay, so for this, it looks like she gave us some vinyl right here for the picture pouch. Um, and it some of the elastic is for this as well. And, okay. Okay, it looks like that's what we got for that. Now, here, I'm going to go down the list. She's got the 20 pieces of pretty fabric, the exclusive Tilda Club Anniversary Needle Minder, the triangle template is for an upcoming block of the month. So this is a two and a half inch triangle right there. Um, and then we have a half hexi template for another upcoming block of the month. So this is a half hexi that Moda put out for Project Jelly Roll. So you may have seen this if you saw Project Jelly Roll um, using the same one for that. There is a Bobble Kiss Clasp. And this is what I was kind of looking at because I'm not sure what it was for. It might be for an upcoming something that's good. I don't know. Because nothing in here that I saw um, had like a clasp. So I'm not sure. But we got that. Um, we got a zipper for the notebook pal. Fold over elastic for the notebook pal. Wool for the needle holder. Elastic for the picture pouch. Vinyl for the picture pouch. A notebook pal pattern, a patchwork needle holder pattern, and a picture pouch pattern. Okay, so that's everything that we got in there. This is so pretty. This is so pretty. I love that. Okay, I'm going to put that over there so I don't... Let me put all of this together so I don't lose it. It'll all be in one spot. Did I get everything? I think I got everything. Okay. Okay. And I'm going to put this over here so that I can put the list in the thing. Okay, so that was the Tilda Club for the quarter. And I've had this for a while too, guys. I'm just, I'm so sorry. Um, but I'm, I'm trying to get caught up. Uh, so, okay, so Liberty League, Liberty Fabric League. I'm pretty sure I have them in order. I, I pray that I put them in order because she she sends them to us in another bag like in a um flat rate bag so that also the box doesn't get like messed up in any way so it comes all pristine and then I take everything out so that I have it ready to go and I don't I should mark them with what when I'm getting them so that I remember but anyway um 
here it is on the inside and okay it says luxury to me is not about buying expensive things it's about living in a way where you appreciate things and that was said by oscar de la renta in this box you will find 12 pieces of liberty tana lawn and some other stuff that you'll see as i pull it out so let's get going <laughs> all right so when i open it up i'm gonna pull the fabric out first because i'm gonna show you that last you know i always do oh my goodness okay so we have um some herbal tea and we have um some pins which oh i love Y'all know I get the buttons. This is by um, the same company who makes uh, the buttons. So just another button company also makes these pins. Um, so cute. I love those. And then we have three um, things of floss. And this is by Someplace Japanese. <laughs> So we have this dusty rose color, a darker blue color, and then like a turquoise color. Um, this says that it is Kinkami Japanese Silk Thread. So that's what that is. And then we have, we got a cute little box. <laughs> so a little present. Oh, some curved scissors. Oh my goodness. These are like, I love these. So they're curved, right? So you can use them like this, like go under something to cut. Beep. Um, I love curved scissors. I don't even, I had a pair. I don't know what happened to them. So this is perfect. Um, okay, we got that. And then we have, oh my goodness. This is, uh, okay, it says Sophie's Garden Pouch and Pin Cushion by Lilabelle Lane Creations. Uh, and it says by Sharon Burgess. So Lilabelle Lane Creations must be her company. This is a pre-printed, or the pre-printed linen is included. Here is the pattern. And oh my goodness. Okay, so um, finished sizes approximately seven inches by nine and a half inches, and approximately one and a half inches by three inches. Holy cow. So, yeah, lovely pattern um, for some embroidery, and you, of course, have your. Um, your floss and then you have um, some pins to put in the pin cushion if you'd like uh, and some scissors to cut with um, let me put that over that way and I'm now going to show you the fabric okay she's now taken to knotting everything so I can't get it untied here you go I'm not gonna be able to put that on my head but it is lovely I love when she does that okay so here's the first package oh my goodness And we get 12 pieces, six in each little pouch. This is the first one. Oh, I love this. The second one, oh my gosh, it feels so wonderful. Oh, oh yeah, rubbing the fabric. Here's this guy. And this one. And this one. This one is number five. 
Okay, let's go into this next little bag. And this one is number six. Number seven. Oh, I love this one. It sort of reminds me of Alice in Glass a little. Number eight. Number nine. Oh, this is so pretty. Number 10. Number 11. And number 12. Okay, so I'm hoping I'm doing them in order. Let's do the next one. <laughs> And this one came shipped like this. And this says June 15th is when I got this. This is embarrassing. <laughs> okay. And here it is on the inside. And... The quote says, the future is the most expensive luxury in the world. And that was said by Thornton Wilder. Okay, so let's get this open. I'm going to scooch over the fabric and show you that in a bit. And okay, so in the box, she says, you will find 12 pieces of Liberty Tana Lawn. And this month's theme is honeymoon. Exciting. Um... Okay, so the first thing that we have, I'm just gonna go down the list to make sure I got, that I'm showing you everything. Um, first of all, I got another Biscoff biscuit. Yay! <laughs> uh, okay, so the first thing is a um, Clover Needle Sharpener slash Minder Macaron. And it is called a Sweet and Sharp Macaron. And mine, it's pink. You can see it right there. Because apparently you can get a mint or a pink. And mine is pink. He's pinking right there. Um, okay, so we've got that guy. Well, that's pretty cool. Okay, and then we have Magnafingers Pickup Slash Release. Oh, here it is. Oh, a magnetic pickup tool. So if you like drop all your pins, you can take this guy and it the magnet inside will pick them all up. And then it says easy release by like pushing back in. Okay, that's kind of cool. Burp, 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 burp. He like does like that. And you can use it for anything that's metal. It says you can use it for sewing, fishing, office, and more. Cool. Okay, and then we have superior kimono silk thread Ooh, and it's pink gotta love that and then we have a pattern this says um this is a pattern for posy pear stitcher's garden there's an iron-on transfer included and you would be um, embroidering that onto your fabric and then you can make this cute little pouch. Oh, and I love how it's got the little key minder on there. We can never have too many zipper pouches, it says. That's true. Zipper pouches are wonderful. Okay, so there's that pattern. Let me put everything back in. I, I like to be able to keep it together so that I know that I have everything. And I don't need to put the candy back in. All right, so let me just close this up and scooch it. Where did I, oh, it's getting caught on the thread. Okay, oh, 
I should have closed the one from before. Hold up. I don't want to lose everything. Which is exactly what I'll do. I don't, hold on, I better put it like that. Does that close up? Yep, it will. Okay, cool. Now the fabric. Oh look, it's a bow again. <laughs> I could almost like, no I can't, it's not long enough. I thought it would, but I got too big of a bubble head, I guess. I'm not going to try to tie it because last time I did that, I got hair caught in it and that was real painful. So I'm not going to, I'm going to learn from that mistake. Ooh, it says this theme is honeymoon and I'm liking the fabrics. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is so adorable. This is number one. Oh my goodness, the next one. Oh my goodness. Number two. This is it, this is so pretty. Number three. Number four. Number five. Sorry if you guys are hearing that. That's just the garage. Jim just got home. Number six. And now we're going to open the next one. Oh my gosh, I'm loving these. Number seven. Oh, so pretty. Number eight. Love it. Number nine. Number ten. Oh my goodness, the next one. Oh, you guys. Number 11, gorgeous. And number 12. Okay, this box, I am I I am in love with it, honestly. <laughs> All right, I'm going to scooch this fabric over and now we're going to open the third one. And you never know, I may need to, you know, put my hair up in another one. So I'm going to take this one out for now. <laughs> and this box came like this. And, oh my gosh, we got this big old box. I'm going to put this over here. The, um... The, the quote says, luxury is the opportunity to experience quality, be it a place, a person, or an object. And that was said by Keanu Reeves. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, this was paper that was on top. I was all like, oh, I was thinking that was like some fabric. And no, it's like one of the pieces of tissue. I'm like, oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, y'all, we got some Milano's. Yes, please. Oh my gosh, I've got so many snacks. I can't wait. Okay, in this box, you will find 12 pieces of Liberty Tantalon, which I'm going to scoot to the side so that I can show you all that last. Um, oh, we have a Creative Grids spider web ruler. Oh my goodness. Creates a variety of blocks using 3 inch to 10 inch strips or strata widths. Depending on the positioning of the light and dark fabrics, the finished blocks resemble a spider web or a four-pieced star. 
Oh my goodness. Very nice. And of course you can always scan the QR code and um, they'll give you demonstrations on how to use this ruler. So that's pretty cool. Um, okay, then we have um, Kinkami Japanese Silk Thread, three pieces. And I have a red, a purple, and this is like a coral color. Very pretty. And then we have some milliner's needles. Um, <coughs> all of a sudden I had to cough. Okay. And it says Jenna Kimball's Fox Glove Cottage Straw Needles. Very cute. Let me take that out in case there's a glare so you can see it a little bit better. There they are, or that's the package anyway. And, oh, size eight, nine, 10, and 11. Very nice, holy cow. Straw needles make needle turn applique easy and smooth. The narrow shank of this fine needle glides easily through several fabric layers without hesitation. Size 11 and 10 are close to the same length. The diameter of the size 11 is extra fine, making the needle flexible. It is preferred for intricate hand stitching. The diameter of the size 10 is slightly larger than the size 11, making it sturdy and resistant to bending. The eye of the size 10 needle is also slightly larger than the size 11, allowing for greater ease when threading the needle. The size 9 is a little longer and stronger than sizes 10 and 11. It is excellent for basting and hand piecing. Size 8 is thicker and longer still for added strength. It is a good choice for the basting step in Gina's back basting technique of hand applique. These excellent English needles are packaged in clear plastic cylinders with 16 needles per package. Okay, so this must this is you know probably like a sample pack, so you could try like all diff all four um, sizes. Very cute and very very handy. I like how they have the descriptions there. Oh man, put it back. Get back in there. Oh, I wanted to stay pretty. Y'all know me. I want everything to stay pretty. Um, okay, so then uh, we have a pattern, and this is by Cut Loose Press. It is, uh, well, this is the pattern. That is really pretty. Um, oh, okay, so this pattern showcases the Creative Grid Spider, Re spider Web Ruler best press spray, soft and stable white, 100% polyester stabilizer, and mirror tiles, which didn't she give us mirror tiles like last year sometime? Um, oh my goodness. So this is, this is great. This is great. All right, there you go. Very cool. Um, so let me put these back in here because I am going to lose it if I don't put it together. That one goes in there. These are the threads. Gonna keep the candy out. <laughs> and now I can show you the fabric. Okay. And it's tied again like a ribbon. Very pretty. I'm liking it. <laughs> Jelly bean is sitting on top of the cat lady boxes. <laughs> okay, so let's get this baby going. Okay, number one. So pretty. Number two. 
I just got to touch them every once in a while. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> Number three. Number four. Oh, I love it. I can't just can't stop looking at it. Number five. Number six. Jelly bean, what you doing, baby? Okay. Oh, this is different. I love it. I'm going to put that one on the bottom. You can see that one last. Number seven. Number eight. Number nine. Number 10. Okay, this is so different. Okay. <laughs> Y'all gonna have to tell me what you think about this one. Number 11. I, I love it. I just, I, I just have to have opinions. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> and then the last one, which I just, I loved it from the second I saw it. I'm going to open this one up too. And number 12. I am so happy that this is Tana Lawn. I mean, honestly. Thank you, Liberty. <laughs> I love all of their fabric, but I love whenever it's fun like this every once in a while, you know? Like, just, I love it. Um, okay. This is the good thing about not opening your boxes until you have, like, a whole bunch of them. Because now, I'm sitting here, <laughs> and I'm surrounded by loads of lovely Tilda fabric. Well, actually, this is not even Tilda fabric. This is Sophie by Brenda Riddle Designs. Um, so, but I mean, hello, 20 half yards of gorgeous fabric. And then I've got 36 pieces of gorgeous fabric by Liberty and it's Tantalon, which is like the best. <laughs> oh my gosh, Julie, thank you so much. You know how much I love you. We need to like talk more. I hope we get to see each other like at quilt, um, uh, quilt market. Oh, I can't even think right now. I, I really do. I can't wait to meet all my friends. Um, it's been so long since we've got to see each other and I'm super stoked. So, um, Amaze balls job. You know, I love it. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Thank you so much. Um, I'm so happy that you guys are watching and I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave any and all comments down below. Uh, anytime that Julie is opening up her membership, I do try to let you guys know as soon as I possibly can. But what you can do in the meantime is I will put a link down below where you can sign up for the waiting list. So as soon as she pops it open, you will get an email right away to let you know that it's open and you can go on over there and join up to get your own lovely fabric from Tilda and from Liberty. So I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks so much. Um, love you guys to bits. Mwah.